Are you ready? Are you ready? Tell me you're ready. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the show. This week, episode number 20. Once again, thanks to all of you because I know you are sharing with five of your friends and uh, subscribing. Are the buttons around here somewhere? Please take the time to subscribe to this channel. We got some more exciting things going to be coming up that we're going to be adding to the show, but you're going to have to keep watching the show in order to see what's happening. We'll uh, talk a little bit more about that later on in the show. All right, so much video footage to show you. Of course, this past weekend being St. Patty's Day, if you were out and about, you know there was a lot of fun, and if you didn't make it out and about, we're gonna show you a whole lot of fun. Here's what we did. We started during the daytime. Uh, my son and I were out, we stopped down at the bookkeeper to see, once again, Jaden the Jester doing a live magic show down at the bookkeeper. We've got some footage for that. And then uh, my son Jason and I, we took a trip down to visit grandma at her residence. She lives down at residence on the St. Clair. And when we got there, there were some Irish dancers. And we'll be talking to uh, a lady from Devoy School of Irish Dance. We'll show you some footage of that as well, an event coming up there. We were also down at Puck Around for some hip hop. We were talking to M. Cass from the Cassidy Brothers. Uh, where else were we? The Stubborn Mule, of course, for Dustin Bones, the Guns N' Roses tribute. And we even stopped down at the Union Station Bar and Grill for the St. Patty's Day Bash with Third Wave and Whiskey Rain. So, so much to uh, do and show you here. So let's get right to uh, the most important, well, not the most important, but seems once again to be most popular. Now, if you remember last week, uh, we had an interview exclusively with Brian Vollmer, lead singer of Helix, of course, coming here to Sarnia May the 5th with the Rock and Country Collide Tour and Canadian artist, uh, country artist, Canadian artist, Marshall Dane, going to be there May the 5th as well. But we went down to London, did this interview. Uh, Glenn and Sean were there along with me. And when we finished, we had to go do something. And something really, 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 really hilarious happened to Sean. He got kicked into you-know-what. Uh, anyway, it was kind of funny. It had to be there. Anyway, this week's YouTube Video of the Week uh, is dedicated to Sean Robbins from Whiskey Rain. Now, if you haven't heard the story yet, you won't get it, but Sean will. And anyway, here's your YouTube Video of the Week. Take a look at this. It's the YouTube Video of the Week. Yo, bro, what you got there? Just eating some SketiOs. SketiOs sounds awesome. Toss me one. All right. Oh! I said, toss me one, bro! Not hit me in the nuts! Skettios, they're for the mouth, not the groin. Enjoy those, they're really good. Uh, a little bit different scenario there, but Sean Robbins, sorry, I came across that and I couldn't help but share that with everybody. If Glenn McKinnon's watching, I know he is, he is roaring on the ground laughing right now. Uh, if you want to know more of the story, get a hold of me on Facebook. In fact, get a hold of Sean Robbins, we'll let him tell his side of the story too. All right, there you have it. Uh, now, as I said, during the day, we've had uh, Jaden the Jester on here before, uh, and during the day on St. Patty's Day, we stopped down at the bookkeeper. Jaden the Jester was putting on a magic show for some children that were there, and also, and he was reading us, doing some storytelling to the children, and we stopped in. Here's just a little bit. Uh, we couldn't put it all on here, but uh, I thought I'd be a little proud and show you the part where Jaden does a really cool magic trick with my son Jason. Here's the footage. And it wore a polka dot bow tie. <laughs> He's not as scary as he has. No. We escaped from the alien and returned safe and sound. It was an exciting adventure. I will always miss that space hound. Cousin Chopper arrived and told him the rain had stopped and the sun was shining bright. He asked if anyone wanted to go fly his kite, or they could take turns on his trike and go for a ride. Can you give me a hand with the card trick? Okay. Okay, come on up. What's your name? Jason. Jason, good to meet you. I'm Jane the Jester. Okay, so see these cards, okay? Everyone see these cards? See how they're all different? Okay, so you're going to pick a card. Don't tell me or no one yell out what card he's going to pick, okay? It's very important. This is a really cool one. See these cards? Okay. So pick a card. Don't show me. I'll turn around, okay? Just pick any card you want. Just hold on. Just, okay, pick any card. Okay, don't show me. I'll turn around. Okay? You're going to put it back. Slide it in there anywhere in the deck. 
Okay. It's in the deck. Watch this. It's cool. Come here for a second. Can you stand on that? Watch this. Pretty cool. Easter egg. Oh. In the Easter. See the Easter bunny? Okay. Is that your card? Yes. I hope it's your card. Is that pretty cool? Yeah. You see it, everyone? Once again, Jaden the Jester, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Jaden, thanks for taking the time to have my son involved in your magic show. He had all the kids involved in there, but I uh, was pretty proud. And uh, we still have no idea how he did these tricks. Talk to Jaden again off camera. He promises to stay in touch with us here on the show, and he might be making an, uh, some more special appearances right here in the studio. So keep watching the show for Jaden the Jester. Don't forget to check out his website once again uh, for Jaden the Jester at digwardthedog.com. Should be on the screen, and we'll have it up at the rolling credits. Jaden, thanks again. All right, so we finished up down at the bookkeeper on St. Patty's Day, and then we went down to visit my mom, or grandma, if you will. She lives down at Residence on the St. Clair, and when we got there, there were some Irish dancers entertaining uh, the residents down there. So we took some footage of that, just a little bit there, and uh, we took the time to have an interview with Dipna DeVoy from DeVoy Irish School of Dance, and they've got an event coming up March the 28th, and we'll be talking about that as well. But right now, here's an interview uh, with Dimpton DeVoy from DeVoy School of Irish Dance. Take a look. Hello, everybody. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Of course, we're making the trip all around Sarnia here today and later tonight. We're going to have some more footage here on the show right now here at the residence on the St. Clair and Dimpana. I said that right this time. Yeah, did I? yeah, you did. Uh, and where are you from? Uh, I'm originally from Toronto, but now I, I live here in Sarnia. Okay. And a school of dance. And what's the, the name of the school? Our, our, our name is uh, the Devoy Academy of Irish Dance. Okay, very good. And we took uh, some uh, video footage that we're going to be showing here on the show. But give us a little history on, on the school. How long has it been around? Um, we started about... Uh, Three years ago, we started, uh, and it was just a, a recreational school. And then this past October, I went out to uh, Vancouver for a three-day uh, long intensive uh, exam, doing oh, okay. written exam, music exam. And uh, so I passed that. So I, I'm now a certified teacher. So now my students are, are able to compete. Awesome. And so how, long, how long have you been dancing? Um, I've been dancing probably close to 20 years now. Oh, so, good, good yeah. for you. Now, um, you've got a special event coming up. Mm -hmm. uh, let's talk about that. It's called uh, It's a Great Day for the Irish, and it's at the Sarnia Library Theatre. And uh, March 28th, the doors open at 6, and it starts at 6.30. And it's just a wonderful night of uh, Celtic celebration. Right. So we have uh, Scottish dancers joining us. Um, we have my Irish dancers, my brother, who's actually just come back from a world tour right. with Magic of the Dance. So he'll be joining us. We have a tap dancer, uh, Robin, coming from uh, London. Uh, so it's it's a wonderful event. There's something for everyone. Great. There's music, dance. Patty Flaherty's is sponsoring it. They're oh, awesome. um, they're h helping us out a lot. Uh, so there's going to be food from them. So that'll be food delicious. from Patty Flaherty's. Okay, there you go. Scott so. Dargy uh, is, is helping you out great. Yes, a bit down he's there, he's right. amazing, and he's helped us out all for for the past four years. That this is our fourth year, and he he's been wonderful. Awesome, very yeah. good. And uh, where can we get some tickets for this? You can get them either at the door, or you can get them uh, beforehand at the Lawrence House Center for the Arts. Wonderful. Yeah. Okay, and we'll have that uh, up on the show. We'll tell you again how you can get those tickets, and we'll scroll out across the screen and know how we do it around here. Dipna, once again, thank you so much for taking the time. Really enjoyed the dance. Good. And uh, good luck to you on your show. Thank you. Okay, okay once again, there's Dipna, and we're going to go back to the studio and talk about some more St. Patty's Day stuff. Happy St. Patty's Day. All right, once again, Dipna DeVoy from DeVoy Irish School of Dance. Thank you so much, Dipna, for taking the time to talk to us. Uh, nice performance down there. Wish we could have put it all here on the show. Remember, she mentioned uh, coming up March the 28th, down at the Sarnia Library Theater, they're going to be having a performance. Now, her brother, Kieran DeVoy, is a world champion Irish dancer, and he's going to be there performing as well, along with some other groups that are going to put a whole great Irish dance show together for you. Tickets available by calling 337-0507. Uh, Should be on your screen there for you once again. And uh, just ask them about this incredible event going to be happening down at the Sarnia Library Theatre. Tickets for a family pass, that's two adults and two children, are only um, $25. And also, if you're just going individually, $10 for adults and $5 for the children. All right, so there you have, once again, Dipna DeVoy, DeVoy Irish School of Dance. Thanks for talking to us, Dipna. All right, we're going to move on to some more other things. But first, we've got to take a quick break. And when we come back, we'll be talking more about what we did on St. Patty's Day here on the show. Stay with me.
This is MCAS, Lost Souls, More Than Music, The Movement, and you are watching the show with David Burroughs. Peace and love. Yep, there you have MCAS from the Cassidy Brothers uh, down a puck around there showing off for us. Uh, uh, we've got some footage of what happened down a puck around. It was a hip hop night, all kinds of different groups. The Diamond in the Rough Tour is what it was called. And well, it was just hip hop happening down there at puck around. We also get a chance to talk to MCAS individually and do an interview with him. And uh, well, here's the interview. Take a look. All right, here we are once again on the show, this time down at Puck Around Sports Bar and Grill. But it's not sports tonight. It's a hip hop review, if you will, happening right. down here. M. Cass is here joining us. How you doing? Great. How are you? I'm really good. You've got to be really excited and uh, pumped up here. Uh, uh, yes. What, what are we going to see here tonight? Uh, tonight, we got the Diamonds in the Rough tour. So uh, my boys are Chatham, Smith Deuce, and uh, Ty Noah Butler. Um, my group exclusive, what we're doing is uh, the Lost Souls, more the music. Right. So what we represent is like the mass, trying to get everybody, like the lower class together, have a good time awesome. showing that music. And, and this, is, this is all original stuff that you guys have all created yourself, is that right? Uh, yes, or the stuff that isn't original, at least promotional use only. Right, gotcha. So like we know, what we do is like we, we run our lyrics, right. obviously our lyrics, but if we get a beat off the internet or... So, yes. Right. So, so it's an art. It's an art and everything's legit. Yes. That's what we're concerned about, right? Definitely. Now, how long have you been uh, uh, doing the, the hip-hop thing? Uh, so since 2009, uh, yeah, three years that. now. Okay. Um, so since I won Hip-Hop Idol for Sarnia, just really? kept moving from there. Um, I got the chance to open up for Young Buck in Mount Clemens and then awesome. seeing the crazy craziness and just seeing like so how I reach the people. Kind of an exciting career so far for you then as well. And obviously uh, yes. a lot of great people in doing this. Uh, definitely. Some other upcoming shows you had mentioned coming up, the Stubborn Mule in August, kind of a, yes, a blowout if you're, you're calling that. What's happening there? Yes, that is the uh, More Than Music, the mixtape release. Um, so as we finalize the business and uh, legitimize ourselves, we want to make sure that everyone remembers we were doing this around here. We were just trying to get everybody to come out and have a good time. So right. we're going out at the Mule. Probably do about you know five to eight bucks a ticket just to have everybody come out. Um, gonna have a lot of great artists. I have a lot of people that are getting on the radio for um, different genres. Right. Uh, Danielle Robert is uh, a definite artist out of uh, Guelph that is just phenomenal. Is getting out, out on the radio and stuff for pop, and she's just awesome. gonna, so a lot of good artists. And we're just trying to get everybody to come out, have getting a good the time. word out there, and have some fun. Yes, All right. Exactly. Now, uh, where can we find you on YouTube? Uh, so we have the. Um, mc.empire.ent All right, we'll get that up on the screen for yes, you folks. Yes, definitely. Um, at hotmail.com, that's where you can reach me. And uh, we have the Lost Souls More Than Music page. Uh, Facebook me. Perfect. Michael Cassidy, MCAS. Lots of, lots of ways to communicate these days yes, for sure, definitely. right? All right, um, well, uh, MCAS, thank you so much for taking the time to be here on yeah, the show. Yeah, stick around, get some uh, Yeah, I'm going to stick around. Footage. We're going to get some footage, check you guys out. Definitely. Once again, uh, MCAS here tonight at Puck Around, uh, the Diamond in the Rough review, if you will. We're going to have some exclusive footage here on the show. Right now, we're going to show you some more Happy St. Patty's Day. Lost souls, more than music. All Passion, right. push, and progress. Check us out. <laughs> All right, once again, there you have MCAS from the Cassidy Brothers talking to us. Thanks so much for talking to us, MCAS. A real gentleman he is, and uh, he had thanked us a whole lot for being there. Well, thank you, MCAS, and all your performers that were down there. It was a great show for hip-hop down there at Puck Around. All right, moving on to some other things. Of course, we were down at the Stubborn Mule for Dustin Bones. This tribute to Guns N' Roses, what an incredible night this was. Of course, we couldn't stay there all night, but we did get a chance to talk to these fellas. These definitely, uh, they're definitely rock stars, and uh, they did a quick interview with us. And then we'll show you some footage of uh, Dustin Bones on stage down at the Stubborn Mule. But first, here's the interview down at the Stubborn Mule with Dustin Bones. Take Here a look. we are once again on the show, this time down at the Stubborn Mule. We've, uh, we've been around all over Sarnia. I'm behaving and I'm drinking water so far. But anyway, oh, we're down yeah. here at the Stubborn Mule, and this time a Guns N' Roses tribute. Very excited. Dustin Bones is here with us. How you doing, guys? How you doing? Woo! All right. And Ziggy, We're ready to uh, get green. You got you got elected to be the spokesperson. I got to be the spokesperson, too, right? Yeah. Uh, talk a little bit about the band uh, collectively. How long have you guys been playing together? Uh, six months. 
Is that right? Has it been that long? Yes. If you say so. Okay, maybe four months. Okay. Maybe three. And, uh, okay, so two. And I heard you don't practice much. We have practiced. It's difficult. <laughs> uh, these guys live in Guelph and Kitchener, and War lives in the East End. We all live in different Saga. cities. Right. We have, we have rehearsed we have more rehearsed. than twice. <laughs> it's got to be a little bit difficult to do that. But uh, what, 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 It can be. What brought Dustin Bones together? What said, hey, let's... Uh, there was no real Guns N' Roses tributes in uh, the Toronto area and in Southwestern Ontario. There's a couple, but they don't do a good enough job. And I thought we could ah, do a better job. I could do better. Uh, well, not that we thought we could do better. We just thought we could represent better and get out and play more. Sure. Right because on. the ones that were doing it weren't playing enough. Now, all together, uh, individual musicians obviously have some past history there. Uh, how long? You're the drummer. How long have you been playing drums? Uh, I don't know, long time. Long time. 25 <laughs> years? You don't want to reveal your age. Uh, well, <laughs> not that I want. No, it's 25 or 30 years. How about years? you guys? What about, what about you? About 25 uh, years. Uh, 10. Well, we're very I excited. Uh, I know you guys are just a few minutes away from uh, uh, getting on stage here at the Stubborn Mule. I uh, hope you don't mind going to be up front there taking some video hey, from you guys. Goal. No, we need we're video. Pumped, right? oh, yeah. Okay. Getting pumped up. All right. Uh, wait, uh, get the best video come a little bit later in the show. Okay. Boone will have a couple drinks and Once then he gets really loose. Uh, Everybody will get loose. Sponsored by enough. Molson Canadian? Is that what it is? No, we're not sponsored by anybody. Jägermeister. <laughs> awesome. We should be sponsored China by somebody. White. Because we're that Folks, good. Folks, I have lost control down here. Once again, down here at the Stubborn Mule, Dustin Bones, moments away from going on stage. <laughs> He's more like Gene Simmons in a sense, isn't he? <laughs> oh, he does that too. All right, we've got lots more to cover. we got to go around town, out of control down here at the Stubborn Mule. Dustin Bones coming up. Don't go away. Rock and roll. Woo! <laughs> Sometimes I feel like I just have no control in these interviews, but that's okay. That's what makes it an exciting interview. Dustin Bones, thanks so much for taking the time to talk to us here on the show. We look forward to seeing you again. Great show for what we saw down there and uh, very entertaining. And War was in the background there. Uh, we kind of had to edit some of his stuff. Sorry, War, but that's just the way it is. All right, Dustin Bones, once again, thanks so much. Now we move on down to the new Union Station Bar and Grill, the old uh, Union Hall, the corner of Indian and Divine. They're putting some great entertainment on every weekend. But, of course, this past St. Paddy's Day, the Rock and Country Collide Tour was down there. Uh, Third Wave and Whiskey Rain put on a sold-out show. This is, I believe, the sixth sold Sold out show in a row for uh, the Rock and Country Collide Tour. Very excited for that. Congratulations, guys. And uh, we got some footage of both Whiskey Rain and some Third Wave. And if we remember, Paul Medeiros and Glenn McKinnon had their little bet uh, uh, about a hockey game a few episodes back, and Glenn lost. Glenn went through 16 jerseys. Now, Glenn said he would wear the Montreal Canadian jersey. Well, he did, under 16 or 15 other jerseys. And he threw out the show, finally getting down to the Montreal Canadiens jersey. So he did what he said he was going to do, sort of. Way to go, Glenn McKinnon. Anyway, packed house in there. 10.30 at night, they had to start a lineup. They stopped people at the door. And uh, we got some footage of what happened down there. Once again, let's go down now to the Union Station Bar and Grill for the Rockin' Country Collide Tour. Third wave and whiskey rain. Here it is. <laughs> Oh, the 
Christ is on your clothes. Just no dollar sign on a piece of mind. All right, there you have it. Once again, of course, a very exciting Rock and Country Collide Tour. Whiskey Rain and Third Wave. Once again, congratulations on a sold-out show down at the Union Station. All right, we're going to take another quick break here show you something very special. Um, we've got a video from MCAS, kind of jumping back there. We had an interview that we showed you with MCAS. And uh, here's a video from MCAS. Check this out. And then when we come back, we're going to talk about what's happening this weekend in your Sarnia area. But right now, here's MCAS. Take a look. Pro for promo, rags to riches, lost souls, follow me, okay. I feel good, I feel great, cause time came, took the pain away. Good, I feel great after the rain, it's a sunny day. Good, I feel great, cause time came, took the pain away. Good, I feel great, ain't these days really crazy, man. I started off with nothing, now I'm focused, got much to say. Don't worry if you hurtin', child, time will take the pain away. Patience is a virtue, so meditate to find a way. Money ain't the root of evil, share the profits which you make. Smile each and every day, never know which one's your last people try to put me down deep inside i choose to laugh anger is a weakness too busy trying to get this cash father figure who would figure this would be the chosen path so the math add the cash divide the wealth just to help accomplish goals dreams seem to manifest themselves i'm overcoming doubt i'm feeling like i made it newest whips get handed to me got me cruising in a spaceship it feels like i made it and i'm finally famous it feels like i made it and I'm finally famous Now I see the feeling sparks the energy I need So I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying I feel good, I feel great Cause time came, took the pain okay. away Good, I feel great after the rain It's a sunny and day I'm... Good, I feel great cause time <laughs> came, took the pain I away feel... Good, I feel great Ain't these days really crazy, man Good, I feel great cause time came, took the pain away hey, Good, I feel great after Fuck the it rain up. It's a sunny Prepare day Good, way. I feel great cause Cause time came, to took show the pain you know away Good, I feel great, okay. ain't these days really crazy, and man I'm good, I feel great, I am a man, I have a plan Living my life to the fullest, till I'm headed to the promised land But I really don't know where that is Somewhere in the sun, sets and clouds, I'll be smiling down You'll be hearing me out, wondering what this life is about I grew up dreaming big, a third child The four, a single mother, raising us Not much that we could afford, but yeah My mother taught me things that money just can't buy Like how to stay respectful when you got a problem, look it dead in the eye And how to stay humble no matter what Always keep your head up Before I see the sunshine, it's gonna get wetter And time will tell, so give them hell, support me well 48 years old, she says she needs a break So I'm 16, wondering how to pay the bill She's working two jobs, stressing out But yeah, she smiles at every meal I ask her how she feels and like there's nothing wrong She hugs me close and says, son, today well, I'm good, I feel great cause time came, took the pain away Good, I feel great after the rain, it's a sunny day Good, I feel great cause time came, took the pain away Good, I feel great, ain't these days really crazy, man Good, I feel great cause time came, took the pain away Good, I feel great after the rain, it's a sunny day Good, I feel great cause time came, took the pain away Good, I feel great, ain't these days really crazy, man Ay. I can't wait till it gets better, man. Ay, I can't wait till it gets better, man. Ay, I can't wait. I can't wait. All right, once again, MCAS there with I Feel Good, I Feel Great. Actually, they put that uh, together. Uh, for one of the campaigns down at the uh, Sarnia YMCA. So congratulations on that, MCAS. MCAS promised to stay in touch with us and uh, allow us to follow them. And we'll have some more upcoming interviews and videos from MCAS and some other hip-hop artists as well. So if you are a hip-hop artist and uh, we don't know about you yet, get a hold of me here. We've got a new email here on the show. Forget the other one. We're going to brand ourselves a little more. The email to get a hold of me here at now is... 
the show at davidburrows.ws. So we changed a little bit. The show at davidburrows.ws is where you can send me all your YouTube video ideas, uh, suggestions. If you want to be on the show or if you want me to be down at a special event with the video camera, send all the details to your event and about you to the show at davidburrows.ws. Of course, our friend Michelle is still going down there at www.sarnyrocks.com, and you can go down there and check out all the events that are happening because I can't get it all here on the show, but check out www.sarnyrocks.com for everything that's happening. Speaking of what's happening around Sarnia and the area, you can also now go to lamptonshield.com, your online news magazine for Sarnia and surrounding area, and now featuring the show on lamptonshield.com. Every Wednesday, the show appears on there, and one click to uh, get to it all. Or, so much communication, right? Visit my brand new website. It's been updated and a little bit of a different look. Check out my website at www.davidburrows.ws. You can go there to watch the show as well as uh, here's some of the music that I've recorded and some more about me if you feel like wanting to know more about me. Okay, so there you go. Uh, coming up this weekend, very proud to be talking about this one. Coming up, some friends of mine from Blind Dog Molly. Going to be down at Boomerangs this Saturday, the 24th. So get down there and check that out as well. Also, coming up, Union Station Bar and Grill is going to be having some more friends of mine. i got lots of friends. Rumblefish will be down at the Union Station Bar and Grill on Saturday. Also, Southern Fried Incorporated is going to be down at the Stubborn Mule, and we're going to stop down there uh, to do an interview with Southern Fried Incorporated. Also hoping to get a chance to come down to Boomerangs to see our friends Blind Dog Molly and bring you some of that footage here on the show. All right, well, I'm just about out of time. Once again, check out serenityrocks.com for everything you want to know that's happening around here. Thank you once again, Michelle, for all of that. Okay, got to move on, but we've got some more video footage here that I haven't been able to show you yet. So as the credits scroll across the screen, remember to keep watching the show because you just never know what kind of video footage you might have in there. In fact, it might even be you. All right. Thanks once again. Don't forget to subscribe wherever I put the button on here. Subscribe to this channel and share with just five of your friends so we can keep getting even bigger and better just for you around here on the show. Okay? That's all the time I got for you, everybody. Have a great week and an even better weekend. And we'll see you next time right here on the show. Bye for now.